Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Melania slaps back hard in legendary response after actress says she lacks her own show at First Lady of the U.S. Watches. In an interview published earlier this week and reported on by The Daily Caller, a black Hollywood actress who has become infamous for her racist views against anyone who isn't black is now threatening to cancel her HBO comedy drama series if she were to discover that our First Lady Melania Trump was a fan of it. Less than 24 hours later, First Lady Melania called actress Issa Rae's bluff by releasing a statement through her spokeswoman, Stephanie Grisham. The statement confirmed that she does indeed like the low-rated show Insecure. But in the typical crying wolf fashion that Hollywood liberals seem to engage in, as of this morning the series was still on the air. Issa Rae is the creator and star of the black HBO series Insecure. Back in 2017, she actually said she was rooting only for black people to win Emmys. I'm rooting for everybody black. Rae told Variety on the red carpet. If Rae wants an awards show that only rewards blacks, she should stick to the BET Awards or the NAACP. Ray's whole racist dilemma started when she recalled that during an interview with Glamour, former First Lady Michelle Obama raved about the season 2 finale back in 2017. She had just finished watching the finale, and she was like, that fake out, how could you do that? I thought you and Lawrence were going to live happily ever after, Ray recalled. Obama told Ray that daughters Malia and Sasha Obama put her onto the series. It was like talking to my auntie. It bums me out that I will never have that feeling again of the first family F. King with us so hard and getting us, Ray explained. The actress is also not afraid to express her views on President Donald Trump. Back in January of 2017, Ray slammed Trump on the Golden Globe's red carpet. Every single time I see a tweet from that man, every single time I see some of the staff and administration he's bringing, it gets worse and worse, she told Variety. The scariest part is how normal it's becoming to some people. I think we just have to keep calling things out like, no, you're lying. That's not true. No, that doesn't work that way. As long as we don't continue to let him slide, there might be some hope, but it's scary. What remains unclear at this point in time is why the actress feels such a clear-cut revulsion toward our first lady. Could it be because of her race? It seems possible based on both the actress' controversial past statements and what she had said to Glamour magazine in her Tuesday interview. Ray also responded to The Root a rabid anti-white blog that for some reason commands respect among the racists in the media and Hollywood elites. Dion Get It Twisted, creating something for us and by us, and maintaining ownership of it, is paramount in Ray's mind, as she told Glamour, the racist blog reported. All I know is who I am. At the end of the day, all I know is my intentions, and no matter what you take out of context, no matter what pictures you post, I know what I am aligned with. I know what my truth is, she said. Here is more on this via bustle. Some people may be confused by Ray's sentiment, that is, her comments about ending Insecure if Melania watched it. But the writer explained that the show's focal point is exploring blackness and that it's primarily meant for such an audience. She gave an example from the show's writing process as well. Sometimes the white writers will be like, I didn't even know what that line meant until I watched the show, Ray said, and I'm like, that's okay. There are some things that are just for us. So now white people aren't allowed to watch certain shows? The truth in this matter is that this actress is a racist. Can anyone imagine this same exact thing being said by any white actress about Michelle Obama? There would be an uproar of epic proportions and that white actress would never be able to find work again. But because it's okay to be racist against whites in today's America this will largely go unmentioned. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.